Hey guys, Tricky2K here. I wanted to give a video to see if I, maybe I can help out some of you that have connection issues. Um, so the tagline is uh, never drive alone and yet there are uh, quite a few people that often drive alone or always drive alone. This is in most cases just because you don't have the necessary ports open in your router. In some cases, um, your ISP or your internet service provider can actually have them blocked for you and you cannot open them by yourself. So if you're unsure on how to do this, actually the simplest way is to call your ISP and just tell them which ports you need open. For this game specific, it's the UDP ports 3000, 3001, 3002 and 3003. They need to be open for both incoming and outgoing. Now, most people have um, net type 2, I believe that's the most common one, you can basically say there are three types. Uh, one is, uh, the uh, one is you can call it like open, which is basically more or less a bridge connection. It doesn't have any blocks on any ports, any ports can be used at any time more or less. And then you have the um, restricted type, uh, which has most of the ports blocked, not all. Um, but use the most common one open. This is the, the most used one and it's probably the, the, the wisest one to use. And then you have the, the totally closed strict one that can uh, uh, only communicate through a few selected ports like port 80 which is web browsing and that sort of stuff. Now the problem in the crew is that if you're on the, uh, the, the NAT type 3 which is the very restricted one, um, you will only be able to connect to people that have open and that is probably just more or less as unusual as the one that has the very restricted one so if you're running around in the world uh, and you see you know people that's probably because you're on a very closed uh, connection type so you need to open up those ports in order for it to get to work now how do i do that you might ask well Again, the simplest way might be call your ISP, but if that's not an option or you want to explore the, the option yourself, uh, basically just um, look under your, your router and Google the manufacturer and model name and then go for manual if you don't have one. Usually to access the, um, the router's main page and set up the, the settings, you uh, type in, in your web browser, um, not HTTP, but uh, 192, down, uh, point down point um Jesus dot I, fuck I forgot how to English <laughs> 102 dot 168 uh, dot zero dot one that's usually um, the uh, the address for, for most routers some use different mine does so just Google to find out and then you need to browse around and the uh, the web user face try to see if they can run any network settings or NAT types. And, and, and most of them you can just specify which ports you want to open and the port range port range you're looking for is 3000 to 3003 for the UDP. There's also a bunch of um, ports um, for the um, Uplay. I don't th think they are that necessary to be honest. Um, but let's see, those ports you need to be open for the Uplay launcher for TCP are port 80, which should always be open, port 443, uh, 13,000, 14,000, and 14,008. You can also he head over to portforward.com. There's a lot of tutorials on how you uh, open the ports for your router, and then there's also software you can use to check if your ports are open. This should solve most of your connection um, problems, but it might not so solve everything. It might also be that you open up the ports in your modern router and uh, then have them locked by your ISP remotely. So you should, um, you know, basically just call your ISP. And they, they can probably do that for you. They should be able to do that remotely and tell you if the, the ports already are open and if you are able to receive and send packages through that. So um, I hope you found this video useful and I hope it sort out connection problems. Um, sad to see some people that can't play the game the way it's supposed to be. Um, I hope you looks into this and, and maybe sort it out in, in the future. Alright, stay frosty guys. Bye.